Good evening, Bacolod City and Necros Occidental. This is Sunstar Bacolod News Bits tonight, bringing you the top stories that you need to know right now. Amended curfew from 11 p.m. to 4 a.m. effective starting tomorrow. Bacolod City and Negros Occidental log 13 more COVID-19 local cases. You're still watching Sunstar Bacolod News Bits tonight. And for the details... The amending ordinance providing for 11 p.m. to 4 a.m. curfew hours in Bacolod City takes effect starting tomorrow, August 8. Councillor Archie Baribar, author of the curfew ordinance, confirmed to Sunstar Bacolod News that City Ordinance Number no. 934 or the Expanded Nuns Social Period Ordinance of Bacolod City was already published in a local newspaper today. The legislation passed by the Sangguniang Panlungsod on Wednesday amended City Ordinance number 927 that required mandatory observance of a non-social period in all public places in the city during the emergency caused by coronavirus disease or COVID-19 pandemic and providing penalties thereof. Baribar said the amending ordinance should take effect a day after its publication. The new curfew hours based on the modified general community quarantine status of the city is shorter than the existing schedule from 10 p.m. to 4 a.m. It can be recalled that the City Council has granted Mayor Evelio Lunardia the executive prerogative to decide on the curfew hours in the city. Thus, the curfew schedule may still change if the mayor intends to do so. Prior to the passage of the amending ordinance, Lunardia in his recent executive order advocated for curfew hours from 8 p.m. to 4 a.m. subject to the approval of the SP. Pending the new pronouncement from the mayor, the amended curfew Curfew hours will take effect Saturday. Baribar earlier said, as long as there's no new action from the mayor, the amending ordinance shall be implemented. As of 8.30 this evening, Lunar Dia has not issued an EO setting a different curfew hours in the city. The Department of Health Western Visayas reported today that Bacolod City has six new confirmed COVID-19 local cases, while Negros Occidental has seven. These form part of the regions of 46 new positive cases as of August 7. In Bacolod City, the agency reported 12 new confirmed cases. The six other cases are locally stranded individuals or LSIs and repatriated OFWs. For Negros Occidental, meanwhile, the province also has 12 new COVID-19 cases. The five others are LSI and repatriates. Both Negros Occidental and Bacolod City remain under modified general community quarantine. Thank you for watching Sunstar Bacolod News Bits tonight. Catch us every night here on Sunstar Bacolod News. For more news and updates, visit our website and social media pages. Get the facts straight. Be the first to know. I'm Erwin Cavera. Good evening.